How bad is the problem? To find out, we parked a car here, across from Ghirardelli Square. We purposely left a suitcase, a guitar, a Bluetooth speaker, and a purse inside. So how are we going to stay one step ahead of the smash and grab bandits? Check this out. Unknown to the would-be thieves, we hid advanced GPS trackers inside everything, including this Michael Kors purse. Then we sat in this surveillance van and waited. So we've been here about an hour now on surveillance, our eyes glued to the bait car. So far, no sign of anybody taking a look, but it's a waiting game. We'll see what happens. An hour later... These guys have been checking out the car a little bit. These two guys showed up. They take several passes by before they strike. One suspect busts the window. It doesn't fully break. 15 minutes later, his partner gives it another try. And off he goes with our purse. Look again as he reaches in. We jump in and take off in pursuit. The guy on the bike ditched the purse, but he still has the speaker. We're close on his heels. This is really tough to follow him at night in San Francisco with one-way streets and traffic. But then we lose him. So we lost the GPS signal, but here's what's left of our car. <laughs> the entire window is smashed out. There's glass all over the ground. Wow. Okay, so he left our guitar and our suitcase in the back, but he took our purse with the speaker inside. Wow. But the next morning, our luck changes. Our GPS comes alive. We track the signal to this building. It's getting closer and closer. Investigative producer Charlie McElravey and I start following the beeps. So according to our tracker, there is a 97% chance that our purse is behind this door. When we knock, Hello? no one answers. By the way, that sign is a past due rent notification. It's moving again. Later that day, the tracker inside our speaker sends out a new signal and we're on the move again. It's pinging somewhere in this alley. Does this couple have it? That's what the GPS seems to indicate. Sir, do you have a speaker on you? A portable speaker? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Can you show it to us? Yeah. And there oh it is. Can you believe that? Holy cow. He says they bought the speaker off the guy for 40 bucks and had no idea it had been stolen. No, I know it wasn't you guys. I know you guys bought, bought stolen goods. Look. There's our tracker, our GPS device. Oh, wow. Mission accomplished. Just unbelievable that we got this back. 